Okay guys, um, to tell you the truth, I kinda saw this trailer, but it's the leaked version of the trailer, the one that was from San Diego Comic Con. So the thing about that is I could barely make out what's happening. I heard Amanda Waller, I heard Deadshot, I see images of a uh, Harley Quinn, but I barely could make it out for most of the action and stuff. So, and I did see the Joker part, so that reveal was cool. but. Now I'm actually seeing the trailer the way it should be. So this video is not exactly a trailer reaction. It's more like a secondary reaction. So let's check it out. It's taking some work, but I finally have them. The worst of the worst. Amanda Waller. And I like the part that, that they did with the logo. Where? And this scene reminds me of I'm the meeting between Cypher and Agent hole. Smith in the first Matrix. There's the rumors of men that some of them have abilities. Oh, yeah. I have seen things. Maybe Superman was some kind of beacon for them to creep ah, back in the shadows. I want to assemble a task force of the most dangerous people on the planet who I think can do some good. They're bad guys. Exactly. And if anything goes wrong, we blame them. We have built-in deniability. What makes you think you can control them? Because getting people to act against their own self-interest is what I do for a living. She is flexible. Diablo. Will Smith? As Deadshot? I mean, Deathstroke. No, wait, Deadshot, sorry. <gasps> Killer Croc. Are you the devil? But I didn't see. All you need to know is you work for me. Nice. Wait, what's that? A goat head? <laughs> Some kind of suicide squad. Title drop. Let's go save the world. Whoa, the makeup looks good. <laughs> oh, with the Batman mask. Nice. <laughs> now they say about the crazy ones. Huh? I don't Oh, I'm not going to kill you. I'm just gonna hurt you. Really, really bad. Nice! Nice! And like I said before, I've seen only the leaked trailer, so I could barely make out the most of the middle part, but I did see the reveal of the Joker, and Jared Leto, really, really, he's good. Man. He's loving this. I mean, wow. I highly doubt he'll be nominated, but if he does, awesome <laughs> for Best Supporting Actor. And uh, this group shot looks awesome. And actually, I'm trying to figure out who are the people in the back. You could barely tell. Um, I see um, Captain Boomerang, uh, Harley Quinn, Deadshot, uh, Katana, Rick something. I don't know that much about his character. I uh, barely read him in the comics. Uh, Killer Croc, and I don't know that much about Diablo also. Wasn't there supposed to be another person? I'm trying to remember. Besides the Joker. But I realized the Joker is not around here. So he's uh, doing all solo, I'm basically? I'm just gonna hurt you. I like this part, though. Really, really, really bad. And it reminds me a lot of uh, the Heath Ledger Joker, just the voice, but at least the appearance is very different. And um, it's weird because at first I'm really not liking the teeth, but 
it's I'm getting used to it. I kind of like it. Jared Leto really pulled it off. I'm not a big fan of the tattoos. I'm really hoping that he covers up most of them in the end. I mean, there were publicity photos of uh, him with the uh, clothes on anyway. But still, I'm not a big fan of the tattoos. And um, Amanda Waller is nice to see her in this. The task force of the most dangerous people on the planet. Good. They're bad guys. Exactly. Yeah, Viola Davis is a good pick. I mean, uh, sure, I uh, really... Wait, wasn't Angela Bassett... Was she in Green Lantern? I'm trying to remember. I thought she would be perfect for um, um, Amanda Waller, but uh, the fact that Green Lantern really sucked. <laughs> but still, um, Viola Davis is a good actress. I uh, like uh, the choice for her. And uh, Margot Robbie, or Robbie, whatever you call her. I've just realized she has a tattoo over here as well, and she has more tattoos. And she looks fine, but the thing is, I'm wondering if they're gonna go back, uh, if her origin story changed or something like that, because I know she creates tattoos, especially for the Joker, but are they still doing that psychiatrist angle and stuff? That's what I'm kind of hoping for. But yeah, she's flexible, all right? <laughs> Don't know much about Diablo, but his uh, tattoos look awesome. And I saw Jay Hernandez in a recent movie called Max, and that was freaking terrible. Uh, Will Smith looks fit as hell. Can't wait to see him. The makeup effects on Killer Croc looks awesome. And I gotta go to that shot with Killer Croc because I thought the makeup was really, really good. Wait, is it here? We're some kind of Let's Trying to remember. Let's go save the world. Let's go save the world. Nope, not there. Where are you? Ah, let's play it again. <laughs> right there. Yep, the makeup looks very good. And his teeth looks awesome. And I like the actor. Killer Croc looks awesome. Um, even though um, he... he The design of him really reminds me of uh, Killer Croc from the original episodes of uh, Batman the Animated Series. You know, the really gray one. And um, it's like a mixture between that one and a little bit of the mutated one from... Uh, what's it called? The Batman Arkham games. But, um, yeah, he uh, looks good. He really, I really like him. And um, I'm still getting used to her outfit, but then again, it would seem like a Harley Quinn thing uh, to have, but still, she's a bit slutty, and I never imagined Harley Quinn as that. But you know what? Uh, Marco Robbie is pulling it off. And, yeah, <laughs> the panda and the Batman mask. Oh, man, the design of that, that's uh, from uh, Bruce Timm's uh, design. That was pretty cool. I don't know exactly what's happening here, but still, there's a lot of chaos, and the music is pretty cool. And uh, Deadshot is uh, coordinating with them. Oh, uh, you do see the Joker right there. I didn't even notice that. That was quick. Ew. <laughs> oh, it says rotten. Okay, it says rotten. And there's a heart tattoo. Okay. Wait, who's getting tortured now? That's the Enchantress. Oh, wait, she wasn't in the final group shot. Okay. Who is that? Oh, is that the... That is Margot Robbie. And that's the Joker's hands. Oh, okay, now I actually see it. All right. All right, so they do have the psychiatrist angle. That is Margot Robbie, right? It looks like her. She has blonde hair. Yeah, has to be. Nice. And uh, Katana's having an emotional moment. Marco Robbie doing her thing. Yes, this is awesome. So I'm that's the Joker, uh Joker's car and Batman's on top. That yes, is badass. <laughs> nice. And hopefully uh Jai Courtney's character. No, they say about the yeah, that is Jai Courtney. Um you know, he is Australian, so he's uh pulling off the accent. <laughs> but still, man. So far, this looks good. And like I said, guys, I did see the leaked trailer, but I could barely tell what's going on. And uh, any other leaked trailers? I did see the Deadpool one, so if there's a Deadpool trailer, it's probably not going to be a trailer reaction because I did see the leaked trailer. But I heard it's going to be something different because the visual effects are not finished. So, so far, I'm really liking this trailer. Suicide Squad looks awesome. Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice looks awesome. Yep. Uh, DC Cinematic Universe. It looks awesome. I'm just hoping that the movies will be awesome. No Green Lanterns! <laughs> Alright guys, so that's how I feel about this trailer. It looks pretty sick.